Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the grind. We have gone 14 and 4. We're sitting at 31,196 skill points. That's 180th place on the world leaderboard. And here are the stats for the old Peatman. Uh, 2,252 hours, 6,329 games, 2,283, and 7,55. And we have 30 days, 21 hours, and 25 minutes until the end of Season 14. What is up, Risk Takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in Risk Global Domination. I have a daily release on YouTube. I'm doing weeknight streams on Twitch. And if you are interested getting better at the game of risk i invite you to subscribe to my channels come along the ride with me ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the grind we're playing classic progressive capitals auto 60 expert neutral bot prog cars balance blitz dice lines are on fog blizzards portals are off i am in the fourth position playing as red i think i take the siberia cap here uh so Sib siberia connects to one two three four five territories I would choose the Afghanistan cap connects to the same one, two, three, four, five, except black put in Ukraine. I don't want neighbor caps if I can avoid it. In the first position, the black plays Tristan Mall, flying the flag of the United States of America. In the second seat, we have Lamb Hide Ho, playing his green, flying the flag of the Netherlands. In the second seat, the purple player is KSDH from Denmark. I'm in the fourth position playing as red. The blue player in position five, United Kingdom flag. General Keir, 19429, playing as blue. And in the final seat, the orange player is Hamilton Z, 1291, also from USA, who capped in the Mideast. So, I won't have access to where. Where don't I actually reach from my capital? So my capital can't control the Oz pocket. My capital can't go west, but it can go east, and it can go east like this. Okay, so what I was just showing you with that connectivity is I reach a wall, I reach a wall, I reach a wall. Whoa, we see 10v5. Oh, we see 10v6. Okay, um, so purple throws and gives me the mid-east cap for free. I take that. That ends purple's game, and it ends orange's probably. Black is upset about this. Yeah, I would be too. I ch My plan now completely changes. I get an almost free mid-east cap in the open. That's ridiculous. Okay, sorry. Yeah, sorry, orange. You're fucked. Um, what I was showing you with the connectivity is my cap cannot reach this pocket. But my original cap can reach the rest of the board through this pathing. Reaches a cap, reaches a cap, reaches a cap, reaches a cap, and reaches a cap to the rest of the board. So I'm not actually locked off from anything with Siberia. And now that I have Middle East, I cap on mid, or I, I stack majority troops on Middle East instead. It's just a better position. Yeah, so orange fucking choked. They're going to go down and steal the. Purple cap from purple. Yeah, so purple's toast. At least orange has something. They're still in this game. Hope they forgive me. And let's make some alliances. Okay. Orange accepts. Green accepts. After black's turn, I'll offer it to black. Blue does not. Black takes Europe. Make any sense for me to let them have that? I don't think so. I think five extra troops early? Too many troops. Okay, green takes North America. Not yet. Oh, yeah. Yes, yet. Do we see seven v four? Man, part of me wants to slam black just to t just to keep them off of 
that early Europe. Please tell me purple doesn't hit orange again. Yeah, he just pisses away his troops. Purple doesn't really appear to know how to play. The card off is two. I think letting a player hold Europe on the second turn makes no sense. Sorry, Black. And blue is going to take the Australia pocket. Purple quits. Yeah. Those two cards aren't super valuable. Excuse me, sir. You stepped on my roadcaster and potentially fucked up my audio settings. If anyone notices the audio settings are off, please let me know because this fat as fuck as McGuckus stepped on my roadcaster, sir. Excuse me. Right. Orange should stack on capital. I don't know why he would hit it too. Guess he wants blue gone out of the pocket. I also don't know why you'd hit multiple cars. You really can't afford to have troops off cap if you're orange. Okay. Do we see black retake? Midi's cap is better than. Siberia cap. Yeah, he he sees that I'm gonna re re break. I think he takes and doesn't guard. <coughs> yeah, he takes and, and yeah and doesn't guard. Just puts troops on capital. I like this. This is fine. So I'll use my extra troop generation to stack on the Siberia position, but my main my main cap stack will now be breaking Europe, I think. I'd rather green and blue get strong than black. Now, hopefully black starts breaking green, which increases the symmetry in the board then all have the same generation as blue. Okay. Yeah, I don't reopen that line. Orange takes Africa. Nope. Pulls the four into the 14. Ooh, does Orange also not know how to play? Tell me they leave troops off cap. Okay. Does Black retake? Or does Black break either orange or green? Yeah, okay. Green gets the hold. Do I just take South America here and try and stay good neighbor with everybody? Try one more turn. I think black gets stronger than me. Not what I want to be. Yet. <coughs> so 
Blue can't break Europe. Green and orange both have nothing to lose. Green's holding as good of a bonus. So green will overtake me and black now. They're on the other side of the world. Green will too, I guess. Orange doing here. Orange breaks North America from the other front? No. He has a lot of off cap troops. Wow. Wow. Black finally decides that he's not interested in wasting his troops and retaking Europe. Okay, cool. I like playing bad neighbor. This is fun. <clears throat> you guys rarely see me go bad neighbor like this. So the reason I'm stacking two on Siberia is two is the amount that that cap is giving me. So I'm not, the cap is never asking me anything. Right? I'm not putting additional troops on it relative to what I'm earning. I'm just sort of letting it generate itself. Blue takes a fifth card. The purple has a four and a one, and then they're worth two. Someone's going to get that purple kill. Maybe it's orange here. Does orange want to trigger the four trade? <coughs> and the answer is, yes, they do. Orange would like to trigger the four trade. Okay, cool. Orange goes two cards up in the sequence, but they take, instead of the 15 trade or the 12, they take the four. I'm going to get the 10 trade now instead of the eight. South America and Africa. Or if black is smart, they don't retake because then I break Africa. Well, black won't. Black retakes. Zero. Yeah, we do. We see a very good neighbor version of this board. Do I just give up the Siberia cap? Do I just keep stacking two troops on it a turn? And perhaps there's a line to the black kill. Trying to piss him off, maybe. Black's like, why are you picking on me, man? <laughs> I think you're the best player in the lobby, that's why. Your cap's the best. You have cosmetics. You aren't keeping troops off capital. Everything about Black tells me they're the best player in the lobby. Dude, wow. A lot of off cap material. That moves to Irkutsk. It stays there. It threatens my capital. Interesting. Well, I don't actually care about that capital as a thing. Yeah, black moves quickly. It 
Okay, green takes the 15, right? Green decides to lock orange on the other side of the board. Orange has cards. Oh, he's killing orange? Interesting. He is killing orange. Okay. That's going to set green in. Great. We lose orange. Love that. He doesn't even path it right, so he ends on a capital. Yeah. It's a really good roll. And sets gets the 30. 25? What is it? No, that was only the 15. This is the 20 trade, right? Lost two players. And I've set on three. I love that. I trade on three here. up my second capital and see so with 56 cap in the middle of the board black's probably super pissed at me am i looking for that black kill not ideal Nobody's going to try and rein in green. I would assume someone would. Yeah, black does. Great. Perfect. And he is going to take the cap off me. But he isn't going to put any troops on it. Oh, he doesn't even bother taking it. Green takes it. All right, so green is the third capital here. Way better than bonuses. Yes, tells me to attack green. Hard skips? What the fuck? That doesn't make any fucking sense. All right, well, if nobody wants my capital, do I put any troops on it? No, I don't think I do. I really don't think I need it. I really don't think I want it. Hey, wow, well, what the fuck do you want from me? I've been picking on you all game. You're lucky I didn't try and kill you. Uh, <laughs> you're really lucky I didn't try and kill you. Blue takes it. Blue doesn't take my capital. What is going on? Nobody wants my Siberia capital. Okay. Well, <laughs> well, shit. <laughs> the, uh, the Middle East cap is just better. Okay, Black takes it here. Yeah, me and Black very equal. Yeah. All yours, sir. Green retakes South America. And Africa. And breaks Europe. Okay, doesn't. Okay. He says, good game. <laughs> You didn't sue it to me? I don't think you will. I don't think you will. I think you're going to play to win. 
Thanks, my cap. Surprise. Oh, oops. Yeah, what are you going to do, guy? You're going to fucking sue me? <laughs> Let's see it. That slams my cap. Quits. He does. <laughs> He does. <laughs> Offer on the lights. <laughs> All right. He gives green his kill. No cards. Okay. He takes a card. He takes a card. Interesting. We go top three. All right. Green should take his kill and set. Oh. Too bad he isn't on two. No, that was an easy way to go top three. Now let's see if I can get a better placement than that. <laughs> we made this man quit, folks. <laughs> we made this man quit the game. Wow. <coughs> <laughs> All right, so what I need to do, which I don't think I do, is I need to set as early as possible or else blue just kills me. If I sit on four, oh, that actually blocks blue from killing me. Oh, that actually blocks blue from killing me. I love that. That's amazing. Tiberia cap just as good. All right, Blue. You can still play the game. Can't actually really kill me right now. I do have a trade. See if Blue wants to win. I don't think Blue knows how to win. Blue's also playing for second? Okay. Well, two of us playing for second won't work. So I, I choose this path intentionally. So I want to open Green's cap and see if they'd like to do anything. Green has an ally. So if we don't stop Green, or Blue has an ally. If we don't stop Green, Green wins. Blue actually needs to play right now rather than just do the whole cap stack thing. 150 doesn't kill me, but they can play. They can involve themselves in this game, or they can just play for second, which I think is what they're doing. Because I don't think they actually know how to play. Okay, Blue doesn't know how to play. Blue's playing for second. Can I play better for second than them? Can I play it for first still? This time I won't break green. I think we just cap stack. Now if blue would like to play, they can play. And if they don't play, we both lose so I should open their capital I should also set immediately when I have a set 
every time. Take a card pass. Yeah, that's better. So let's still just take a card and pass. Yeah. I think that's game. I don't see a future where I get better than third if uh, blue isn't willing to hit green. General Keir plays for second, huh? Nothing stopping blue from playing to win. Other than the fact that I guess he probably just lacks the skill. Um... So black, I, I overestimated, right? Black, I thought, was a good player. <clears throat> and he just, he got real fed up with me antagonizing, which is kind of humorous. Uh, so I'm going to break one of green's bonuses, but if uh, if blue isn't on the team, that's that's it for us. So. No set on four also. Very fatal. I, I die to either of these guys now. Looks like a GG for us, folks. I don't think we survived two more turns. Not when, not whilst sitting on five cards. And blue locks his capital in. Wow. Too bad. Okay, that's game. Quick one. Weird third place finish. But when one of your opponents is unwilling to actually play, you have no games. There's, there's no solution to this puzzle, right? I've tried everything I can try to encourage uh, blue to hit green. Um, but blue has no instinct for self-preservation. They're just truly playing for second. So, uh, we don't open their line to me because now we don't want them to get first. They've chosen to not play for first, so we won't give them any option. Um get my well we'll give them less of an option to get my kill but i think green takes it anyways because so i think green easily has 220 after a set and their troop bonus right if blue's interested in playing he sets and hits some green somewhere takes the siberia cap does something right green was hoping I, or blue was hoping i would open them so that they could snag my kill on five maybe the trades are 65 Green sets and kills me off the 169 cap here, for sure. So, I die. Yeah, too little too late from blue. If I don't die, I'll be shocked. Green should set and kill me. Takes the capital, doesn't guard it. Maybe blue's just a massive, massive noob. All right, green. Set, kill Pete. Yeah, that's the first part. Yeah, lining up to make it. That's the second part. Yeah. And wapa, 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 and die. I get third. I pissed off black too much. <laughs> oh, shit, he gets a bad roll. Look at that roll, guys. Woo! No set on four. Lady. He's a gentleman. All right, I'll stick around to the end of this game because uh, Blue's toast. Blue's absolutely toast now. He stands zero chance. Well played. No, not, not well played. You are you are pathetically bad, General Kier. You you played for second one. You could have totally totally been alive. Oof. We we're going to we we're just going to say, hey, General Kier, you happen to be watching the show. Which you won't because you're a novice. But if you're happening to be watching the show, lots of teachable moments. <laughs> There's no way this guy watches the show. Yes. Hmm. So the line here, folks, 
Green puts a nominal amount here and then runs off this line. Oh shit, never mind. Take that. It's actually a good fortify. <laughs> I want to see the end of this game because I want to see what uh, what I derank to after a third place finish. I also want to see who's who's what. I think Green has this on lock, but he's not good. The game does seem to be dragging out. Yeah, wow. Green doesn't realize he has the win. Doesn't actually see how to win the game. What you do for your green guys is you take most of the board, you take the additional capital. That forces blue to break you every turn. What a weird scenario. Opens the cap. I almost can't watch this because these guys are so bad at the one we want. You here's you roll the 72 off the 61. Clean with the 199. Go this way. Make sure you also get that. Yep. So yeah, at least he's doing that. Don't leave the stack in, right? Like 20 troops in. And good enough. You go the other way first. This way. Potentially leaves troops in the pocket. Yes, you take everything. Make sure you end on capital. Man, a lot of these caps have no troops on them. If green misses a fortify, blue can win that way. Five goes down. Fortifies to mid east. Don't miss the fortify. Oh man, he misses the fortify. Ooh, that was close. Blue actually has a line to win here, because green is so terrible. <laughs> I mean, blue's also so terrible, wow. These guys are both like fucking novices or beginners. <sighs> wish I wish I didn't miss that set. I would definitely still be alive. I also have no regrets about antagonizing black. I think that was hilarious. I, I wouldn't have expected a player to suicide so early over a bonus in progressive cabins. <laughs> he went down from like maybe a master or jam to my estimation to like a beginner. Okay. Bad roll. Okay. Blue's throwing here. Blue can't afford to throw troops into caps. And he's two trades off a set. Oh, God, he leaves his troops in South Africa. Ugh. All right, now green takes the whole board again. Yeah. So now green has left his stack on a locked capital. I thought green was going to win easily, but it actually looks like a bit of a grind because he sucks. 
He's letting blue recover too much. <laughs> yeah, blue should 100% sit his stack there. But he doesn't. He moves into Australia. Okay, fit, cleans the pocket. Puts back on Ukraine? Or puts back on Siam? Either of these guys miss a fortify, their game is over. Puts back on locked Siam. Okay, so green can take the whole board here and just not open these two territories. That gets the 90. Also, what he should do is he should leave troops on each capital as he takes them. Or he tries to hit the stack. And cap run. Good. Game over. You both played embarrassingly badly. <laughs> no! No, no, no. Win the game. What do you... Oh, no. Oh, no. He doesn't... He doesn't win a one game. Oh, goodness gracious, folks. I'm going to lose so many skill points because these guys are both fucking novices. <laughs> Take the caps. You've won. What are you doing? You're letting this guy get 20 fucking troops. You're out of your mind? You've won. You've won the game. Just take the capitals. He has no troops on any of his capitals. Yeah, just take them. Take them all. You have this game. One, two, three, four, and five. Win the game, please. Why aren't you moving? <laughs> Why aren't you moving faster? That's one. No, that's not one. Why don't you? Jesus Christ. How, how many fucking times have I asked you not to step on the desk? Please. Please. You're going to step on my roadcaster. It's going for world bomb, I think. All right. He's, he is going to reach Mexico. Please tell me he reaches Mexico. He doesn't reach Mexico. You know, Reggie boy. Reggie boy. What is happening? What is happening? Ladies and gentlemen. Oh my God. He's going to sit on fucking South Africa. Bro, don't do that. This guy has a set now. Hey, what did I ask you? Come on. Listen. Gotta listen. Come on. I asked you not to. You're going to step on my audio settings. Guy, I tell you. Okay, no set on four. Is it, could it be? <laughs> could this game be over? Breaks Asia. Doesn't even roll the right territory. This is a nine point play if that 2v1 landed. <laughs> cost cost green nine troops <laughs> doesn't even attempt to roll it come on green set take the 32 cap set take the 32 cap please win this fucking game please jesus fucking christ all right we're gonna get to see the ranks after all yeah you suck blue you should have played to win you suck green you should have won way sooner i'm such a hater dipping on that hater raid folks all right let's see had ho and ranks everyone sucked i thought black could have been a master but they're an intermediate best beginner yeah yeah everyone sucked oh blue was the intermediate blue was the best player in that game a guy who played for obviously played for second will definitely get you intermediate rank because as i like to remind folks the ranking system is broken all right we lose a bunch we lose no, only about a game's worth. Rank 224. There you have it, folks. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you found some of this fun and entertaining, maybe even a little bit educational and informative. You are interested in getting better at the game of risk. Don't watch this game. because everything I wouldn't recommend doing. None of that. Nothing I did. Nothing other people did. It was all bullshit. But in general, you can sub to the show. You can like the show. You can send me good vibes because I'm sending you good vibes. I love you. Have a great day, morning, night, evening, wherever you find yourself. For all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.